Alongside Grant Hill and Brent Berry, I'm Brian Anderson. Also with us tonight, our reporter, Allie LaForce. You look at the Warriors. All right, Brent, all eyes on the center matchup in this one. What's your outlook on the future of the big man as the league continues to evolve? Well, they're not extinct. If you find one, you're going to use them, B.A. So if that's your advantage, you got a big guy who can score down low or dominate from the paint in some way, uh, then the coach is going to feed the big fella. Now here's Lowry. He can't get that one to fall. Oh, nice D from Curry. To the inside. And it's Green missing. Hero outside. Pass to Adebayo. Fires from 14. Can't get it to go. Missed his first one. Green with the ball. Back to Curry. Jacks up a three. It's not going to go for him. Butler with the ball. Green picks him up. Now Martin. Puts up a three. Again, the Heat misses. And here are the Warriors now. Well, an all-star appearance for Bam Adebayo in 2020. Grant, you think he can get back there? No doubt. I mean, I think the bigger issue is we've seen his numbers taper off just in the postseason. Can he reverse that and bring his best when it matters most? Now here's Adebayo. And you look at his numbers, just over 21 a game. No, it's early, but going 0 for 4 to start. game can make a team get a little bit tight just great positioning to get the rebound then get it back up the three from curry curry with another miss well, the d really getting away with one there no one on him and that's going to be good nine out of ten times out to lowry takes a three and it's Stephen Curry with the rebound. And the Warriors with possession. Looking for their first basket of the game. Bounds. Out of bounds. It'll be Heat Ball. And the foul Warriors called on foul. Draymond Green. Draymond Green. That's his first foul of the first game. Personal foul. Second team foul. And Miami has possession. Here's Butler. Butler. And it's Butler with the jam. Caleb Martin. The defenders are trying to keep pace with Jimmy Butler, but there's enough space for him to spot the rim and knock it down. Here's Curry. Finally gets one to go. That makes it one for five in this game. After missing his first four shots, he finally gets one to drop. Butler with the ball. Now guarded by Curry. Out of bio from long range. Can't get it. He's now one of four from the floor. This is a rough stretch right here for him offensively. Seems to be rushing shots. That was execution to perfection. Textbook transition offense. Yeah, once you burst through a seam like that, you got to look right towards the rim. Sweet play. Two minutes remaining. Ooh, old school Two. right there. No easy buckets. Well, Brent, you look at Miami's playoff pedigree. They've made the Eastern Conference Finals six times over the last 12 years. Yeah, and those two championships they had in that 12-year period were square on the shoulders of their big three that they put together. But I don't see them slowing down when it comes to reloading. This team knows how to do it well. They get it back. Pass to Curry. Down to five on the shot clock. And there's the shot clock violation. Couldn't get the shot off in time. 
Miami ball. And Miami has possession. And the foul called on Victor Oladipo. Victor. That's his first foul of the game. A great job to establish position and square up. Off the inbound. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. First personal foul. Well, Brent, not many players love the grind of the game like Stephen Curry. Well, when you get to a point, B.A., where you're practicing, you only count the makes if it's a swish, and you count it as a miss when you hit the rim. Attention to detail like that gives you all-time greats like Steph Curry. Time called here. Miami decides to talk it over. Defeated by Detroit in their last game. They'll try to put that one behind them. It seemed like coming into that game, they looked a little off, and they never really hit their stride. Yeah, and that score got a little bit lopsided, so not the kind of effort that they want to repeat anytime soon. Seven left in the opening quarter. Now Butler. And you look at the numbers, currently around 22 and a half points a game. Here's Lowry. Count it. And that shot gets him in the books. He's one for three. And the dribble move by Lowry just setting up that play, toying with the defense, getting it done. And here's Curry for three. And Hero grabs the board. Time for some consideration in the passing category, maybe, Kevin. The shot is just not on. Get somebody else going. Out of bio from long range. Offensive board. Second chance shot. Butler. Oh, he got him with a pump fake, but he couldn't finish. Thompson, no good. Well, mid-range is where he makes the money. So when the D's slow to get out on him, always surprising to see him miss from there. Assisted by... Count it. Kyle Lowry. And you would expect a quality play like that from a quality guard like Kyle Lowry. The three from Curry. It's hauled in by the Heat. And this feels like it's snowballed a little bit on them. The more he tries to shoot his way out of this slump, worse it seems to get. They need him to get it together. Ooh, an open look for Hero. Oh, and he just he knocked down the buzzer beater. Great job ending the quarter on a... And so the first quarter is in the books. Heat out in front. They lead by five. And back to the start of the second quarter in... Fans, give it up for your Warriors. You. If you're just joining us, we played through one quarter in this one. Let's quickly break down what we've seen from the Heat. Just excellent first quarter defense. They've been really getting after it. Just a, a great job, really, of making the game ugly, trying to muck it up a little bit out there. The three from Curry. He came out today planning to do as much damage from three-point range as possible. Well, it looks like it's time to change up the plan, guys. He buries it from three. Well, Grant, every team is looking for that perfect five on the floor, that magical lineup. In your mind, is that synonymous with small ball? I think it is, B.A. I mean, having players that can play small, can switch on defense, obviously play multiple positions on the offensive end. It's just a combination when executed properly could be a nightmare for the opponent. He shoots. Off target. That would have pushed the lead to double digits. Here's Poole. That drops. And it comes off an assist from Curry. Poole's got his second bucket on the night. And Poole just going right through contact. I mean, this guy is getting better and better. Here's Struess. Who poked away. Here's Love. Kevin and Love. a nice finish on the layup. Second chances 
are a great measure of what a team is doing in terms of their effort on a nightly basis, and that was some serious effort there. And the foul called on Victor Oladipo. That's foul number two for him. That's two fouls in as many quarters. He may have to adjust his approach now. The Heat making a switch here. And here's Curry for three. Sends it home from three-point land. Curry's got six. Well, to have a soft touch is one thing, but to do it from 25 feet? Come on, Stefan. Back to Adebayo. Love for three. And the Heat, another three. Three ball. These teams are finding the range, showing a lot of confidence. It seems like they're going to find out who can make the deepest threes. Right now, it's a shootout. Curry's shot is off. <laughs> Just terrible defense. I don't know how he missed that shot. They grant so much young talent for the Warriors. Many said they should trade for veterans, but they resisted. And they won a title anyways. I mean, with the salary cap perhaps their greatest obstacle, having contributors on cost-controlled rookie contracts sure helps. A moment to hear from Ali LaForce. Well, guys, Jimmy Butler's focus is all on team success. In fact, his agent said whenever he calls Jimmy to congratulate him on personal accolades, like All-NBA Team, for example, Jimmy hangs up in his face before he can finish the sentence. Ryan for Butler, there's only one prize that really matters. Yeah, he's a rare breed, Allie, for sure. Thanks for that. Thompson outside. The kick out, Curry. Fires the three. It's hauled in by the Heat. They have a decent advantage in regards to rebounding. Here's Adebayo. And Adebayo slams it in. Bam is really good at getting out as a big, running that lane, and being a weapon to finish on the break. Curry's shot is off. And here are the Heat now. Next up, the Knicks in New York. Love for three. Nails it from three. Love's gotten his third basket of the night. It took a little bit of time, but now he's taking the pen off the cap and putting his mark on this game. Pure from three-point range. Yeah, he couldn't connect on anything from outside in the first quarter, but now he's hit two threes in the second quarter, and he looks much better. Time called here.